The state fire marshal is investigating whether an apartment fire was intentionally set. That fire happening in San Marco. Fire crews had to rescue a woman from the second floor. She was taken to the hospital with difficulty breathing, but later released. So these are some of the images from JFRD showing the inside of the building. That fire burned eight units, two of them destroyed now. News for Jack's reporter Eric Avignon is joining us live from the complex in San Marco to give us another look at the damage. And Eric, help explain why arson is suspected. Well, arson is suspected because the guy who was living here, the tenant who was living here, says that uh, some kids started this fire. Now, we're outside apartment number four, which is where the uh, fire originated, where firefighters say their fire originated. So I'm going to bring you inside and give you a tour of the place. As you can see, uh, it is a very small apartment. Uh, Everything in here is destroyed. The walls, the floor, the furniture, it's all charred. If we can swing the camera and bring it back this way here, I'm taking it to the kitchen. Everything in here is just completely charred. There is nothing salvageable. Now, the person who was living here has been identified as uh, Christopher Yorkie. What we have learned uh, through our own investigation is that recently Yorkie received an eviction notice. Uh, and according to this notice, I have the notice right here. If we can swing the camera, I just want to uh, show our viewers this right here. Uh, this was just filed. Uh, actually, it was it was a, it was filed on the 15th, but it was finalized and filed again on the 29th. Uh, however, however, the judge did not sign off on that eviction until uh, last Friday. Now, according to everything that's in here, Yorkie was being evicted because of behavior, uh, according to because of a uh, bad behavior. Basically, we were told that. Um, Neighbors had complained of some suspicious behavior uh, that was detrimental to them and other uh, tenants in this in this particular building. Now we did, in fact, talk to Yorkie right after the fire was put out. Again, he tells us the fire was started by children. Take a listen. Some kids burned my apartment down. Some kids burned my apartment down. What did they get inside your apartment? Did yes. They yeah, they broke in. Yeah. Okay. You're looking at me so funny. I couldn't, I couldn't see how they started the fire. I just saw through the blinds, you know. They're, they're okay. It's going down. Again, all eight units have been impacted, two of which have been completely destroyed. That will be this one, and I believe this one as well. And one other note, we were told that the reason why this entire building did not burn down is because of this. It's all brick, and that is what was able to help keep the structure up. So, of course, we're going to have more on this coming up later tonight. Reporting live, Eric Avignon, Channel 4, The Local Station.